On my way home from practice, my phone rang. It's coach. He told me to turn the car around. Come right back. We having a second practice. We got a big game coming up. But before I get into this, look at my man on the left. He going in in the whip. He listening to that Uzi. But now, on a more serious note, we are going to Houston for our very next game. And we are about to play the Rockets. The best team in the league, James Harden averaging 24 points per game. He's obviously the best player on a team, almost four and a half rebounds, almost eight assists per game. This man, James Harden, is having one of those MVP type seasons. He even shooting above 50% from the field. He never done that before in his career. Now our squad, look at our squad. This is who we going up against them with. Evan Fournier, uh, Jonathan Isaac, he a rookie. Aaron Gordon, he's fire. Nikola Vucevic, he's fired, but we got Shammy off the bench. All he do is shoot. What is he going to do? And one of our top three-point shooters and defenders, Marvin Williams, is out hurt. So I roll back into that practice. Coach said, let's go in. I'm out here dunking. I'm out here dunking on my own teammate, R.I.P. Terrence Ross. But I was doing more than that. I was giving out the buckets to everybody. Whoever wanted it, 1v1, hey, we can get that thing, you feel me? Snatch back, hold up, what you doing? Oh, you still can't guard me? Let me go ahead and get that contested bucket. And even Shammy was catching this work. Even Shammy was catching all this work. And not just on offense, you know what I'm saying? Shammy was catching the work on defense, too. Watch these clamps. I'm up 3-1. to one. Shammy thought he had me. No way, Jose. But you already know how I rock. I'm on that Hall of Fame difficulty. 10-minute quarters. We about to play the Rockets in Houston. This game about to be crazy. At center, 16, 10 inches, number 15, Clint Cavanaugh. At point, 6 foot 0, number 3, Chris Paul. Swagging players, this is your boy Stax Montana, man. Look at this BS. But we back out here on this NBA 2K18, my career featuring young. Look at this BS. When have James Harden ever been that fast and that good on defense? How did he get to me so swiftly and quickly? I just don't understand it at all. I'm doing a layup. I don't know where James Harden got clamps. But it's all good. We got something he can't clamp. Because we got Freddy Ferrari. FBZ. The young homie with the dunk. Go. Oh, Freddy. All the way to the rack. James Harden couldn't keep up right there. You see, he just put his hands back. He said, I ain't going to try to block this one. But look at the BS continue. Every time we play the Rockets... The Warriors, the Cavs, any type of good team, BS things seem to happen. But we going to take control tonight. Oh, yeah, we going to go all the way in tonight. And my plan in this game was to just score, 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 score. And when I finish scoring, I'm going to score some more. I'm going to keep getting buckets. I'm going to go to the rack. I'm going to get them easy layups. I'm going to get them garbage points. I'm going to get them free throws. I'm going to shoot that mid-range shot, that leaner. I'm going to do whatever I got to do to get a bucket out here. And look at me. Pass the ball to the teammate, to the homie. And getting the right back. Go ahead and lean on him. Let me get another bucket. Any type of space Chris Paul gives me, I'm shooting it. And that's facts. These guys got the ball. And so far, man, we've been playing some good defense on the Rockets. You know, they made a couple BS shots, but we've been playing some good defense. Look at the Euro step. Look how we just step right around that man. Got the layup. That man Freddie going in right now, bro. He going all the way in. 
I had to pass it to the corner right quick. Right back, Hernan Zonia. You don't need this ball. I'm trying to score. He contested it, but we still made that thing. And at this point, if you Chris Paul, you kind of kind of got to be salty. Because you a midget, and you're trying to block a shot. It ain't going to work out. Your boy got subbed out to start the second quarter. We only up by three, man. These guys out of nowhere hit like six threes in a row to end the first quarter, bro. I was too salty to even edit that into the video. But finally, they missed the three. And I'm ready to get right back into the game. But when I got back in, bro, the game was tied up. You know what I'm saying? So at least we're not down by 20. Look at this man guarding me. I had to call that quick isolation. He can't guard me. Step back, pull up, bucket. Nothing. But net. This man, Clint Capella, really thought he could guard me. Look at this BS Chris Paul just made, bro. Look at the BS these guys are making, bro. But if you go cheese... I'm going to cheese right back. I hope you did not forget this man. Freddie is a slasher. Clint Capella, boy. Clint Capella, boy. You better not ever jump with this man, Freddie, again. And we right back to getting these assists, man. Don't forget we are triple-double chasing. We like Russell Westbrook out here, bro. We trying to average a triple-double. Chris Paul with the ball. It's time to clamp this up. We time to lock this up. And this man, a little baby in the paint. I just laid it up right over him. Chris Paul, I do not see you, brother. You is a little baby. But we gonna go ahead and get to the second half of the game, bro. Third quarter. It's time to keep the clamps on these guys. Look at my guys with the defense. And I throw it to Vucevic. Nobody gonna stop Vucevic. That man go to the back. He do that one-two step. It ain't even European, bro. But his the way he do it is kind of like he, he kind of do like the Australian step a little bit. You feel me? Classic pick and roll. Vucevic doing his thing in his game. And you see the lead we got. I didn't know where the BS started to happen again. We up 11. I'm at the free throw line. Oh, so confident. Haven't missed a free throw all game, but look at this. 80% chance missing that thing. They throw the ball down to James Harden. He dunk it, bro. Look at the BS that's starting to happen in this game. And look at this. Even Vucevic started to do BS. 100 pump fakes, missed the layup. I thought he got slapped in the back of his neck. No foul call. This man, Shammy, got in my way. We couldn't stop James Harden. Another layup. And things are starting to go left. Things are starting to go the direction we do not want him to go. Shammy wide open in the corner, and he misses. Out of nowhere, my team cannot make a single shot. Look at this contested layup. Look at this BS. You kind of got to expect this when you're playing up against the Rockets or another cheesy team, man. Now look at the score. We only up by four. But don't worry, bro. We're going to keep doing our thing. How did Shammy miss the wide open three in the corner? But then make that one. Yeah, that, yeah. Things are going crazy in this game. We forced James Harden to shoot a bad three. And like I said, we always triple-double chase so I had to go and get that rebound right there. Chris Paul guarding your boy. Never mind, Chris Paul not guarding your boy. An easy layup. We going to keep on hooping. It's getting late in this third quarter, bro. We finally starting to pull away again. Look at the defense by the squad. Me 1v1 with Chris Paul. And I ain't treat him like a baby this time. I just stopped for the mid-range. Pulled that thing. Oh, netted that thing. You feel me? And now look at this guy at the free throw line. He know he had no confidence. This man ended up knocking. Well, not knocking down, but almost knocking down the rim with that brick. Your boy leaning, leaning, hitting another bucket. More buckets, bro. Chris Paul, man, I ain't going to flex. Chris Paul been having a hard time trying to guard your boy now. Look at the homie wide open in the corner. Didn't want to shoot it. It's all good. We two rebounds away from the triple-double anyway. We don't need no more assists. We going for the buckets. James Harden cannot guard this boy, bro. We seen James Harden cannot guard this, the young homie, the young Freddy. But Rory step back, cross over to the end. 
one swag. That man, Freddy, going in. James Harden still don't know what happened. He said, all I know is he went right, and the next thing he know, he was on the left. He drove through the basket. I was on his back. I found him and won. But, yeah, that's exactly what happened, James. Now your boy at the free throw line. We already missed the 80% free throw. So we got to try to get a free throw percent that's higher than 80. We get 79, and it goes in. So... I don't know. Free throw ace is a joke to me, if you're being real. Free throw ace is a joke. We're in the fourth quarter now, though. This is what things really matter. And it's time for us to keep on going. A floater down the lane. We up by 20. Out of nowhere, things started going left, bro. I don't even know what happened. These dudes shooting contested, leaning threes in the corner. Your boy grabbed another rebound, one more rebound, and we got that triple dub. Chris Paul cannot guard your boy. Ryan Anderson stripped your boy. I got the ball. My man Jonathan Isaac passed it. Chris Paul jumping out his shoes. And then another easy layup for me. Another bucket. Had to go ahead and get that bucket, you feel me? This man James Harden dunking on the fast break. But don't worry, James Harden, I'm going to show you something a little bit doper than that. A little bit more fire than that. Than a regular dunk. We going for the win. Mill on your head. Clint Capella, I'm surprised you're still jumping, big fella. Then Ryan Anderson with the trash shot. <laughs> Ryan Anderson, I don't know what you was thinking, bro. I don't know what that man was thinking. Pick and roll with Aaron Gordon. He dunking. Whole squad dunking. The squad turning up on the bench. But after that, man, the game was pretty much over. We trained hard. We played hard. Oh, we definitely won hard, bro. Riding around the city in the whip, going to practice. If you guys want to see more GTA Grand Theft Auto 5 intros in my, my career 2K videos, let me know down below in the comments. Also, drop that like, you feel me? If you enjoyed this video, if you are new to my channel, go ahead and subscribe. You're not going to want to miss the heat. I'm going to be dropping real soon. And trust me, everybody knows your boy drops that heat. So like I said, you want to see more GTA intros in my videos, let me know. Go ahead and leave a like on the video. If you enjoyed this video, go ahead and leave a like on the video, man. And if you're new to the channel, go ahead and subscribe. We got that dub. The dub we oh so desperately needed. Against the Rockets, we went out and got that thing. I'm so happy we won this game. It lets us know that we can compete against top teams in the West just in case we make it to the finals. I feel for like this Magic team is going to be tough making it out the East. But anyway, until next time, players, real fans, stay up and I am out. Swag team, bruh. Zombie gang, cuz. And you already know how I do things now. I showed you at the beginning of the video. Your boy is on that Hall of Fame. Let's go. Yeah. Damn, let's go, baby. DJ, fantastic game. Thanks. Listen, Kevin and the guys want to talk to you back at the studio. Right, right this way. Let's do it. Hey, this is Kenny. Not much to nitpick about your game, man. Plenty of points, plenty of rebounds. What was your mentality when you were down there battling on that block? Kenny, my mentality is that there is no way anyone in the league can throw me off my game when I'm down near the basket. Now, if you were to create a Frankenstein of all the best skills, of all the best post players in the league, it would look a lot like me. You know, well, well not as many, you know, stitches or bolts coming out of my head, but you get the picture. Um, I get the picture. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I do. I like guys like you, man. Yeah. Good job, brother. Yeah. Thanks, man. I'm a beast.